Nemesis Hill Climb. Will we ever get up without crashing? First, we have to get to the hill climb. And this nasty section is tough enough. It's all about traction. Or lifting the bikes through. David is 65 years old, so it's great to see him tackling the hard enduro terrain. This is seriously beautiful countryside. <laughs> we should come back one day and do a bushwalk. There's no time to really enjoy the scenery when you are wrestling a big lump of metal. I have bad memories of this section. <laughs> I was trapped under my bike and needed someone to rescue me on the last ride. And here's the hill climb. The Husqvarna goes first. An Austrian motorbike is a huge handicap, of course. Jeff has an amazing run. He almost makes it in one go. That is what we have been aiming for on this hill climb. My turn. The problem is these tree roots. We automatically slow down, which means you don't make it. Woo! That's my best. Whew, it's time for a rest. And let's see how the Husqvarna goes. Started. She's on the starter motor or something. You okay there? I offer to pull the bike up so we can avoid wrecking the track with wheel spin. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, no, no. I ran out of space no, to no. move. <laughs> now it's just David on the Sherco. Can the French motorbike make it? Mate, if you find it too easy, I'll jab you with this stick. I am always ready to offer support. How about David? This is always a problem with motorbikes made in the Northern Hemisphere. They always orientate themselves that way. It's not a crash. The wheels aren't on the ground. Ah! Oh, get it up! Get it up! 